Okay, so girls, we're gonna start with our feet in first position here, and we don't need a bar. So the feet in first, they're like a big open V, and every time that we bend our knees, our knees are tracking over our toes. Remember, we have little lasers tracking over our toes. And we're also thinking that we're, if we're in a toaster here, we don't wanna lean forward, because that's gonna burn our nose and burn our bum. So we're gonna stay up nice and straight. Imagine that there's a nice little line in our side, we're staying on that line, knees are tracking over our toes and squeezing back up. So from here, we're gonna do our plie exercise. So from here, feet are in first position, a grade two plie exercise with our normal music. So from here. <laughs> as hard as I possibly can. So that's on the way out. We go demi-point, point, 
And on the way in, we reverse it. We go demi point, close. All the way into third position. Let's go two to the front, one to the side, rise and lower. Our arms are gonna be in bra bar the whole time. But if you feel like that's too hard to wobble, then from there, you feel free to put your hands on your hips. So you get to choose arm bra bar or hands on hips. Let's go with the music. And we've got two to the front. Demi point, point, demi, close. Demi point, demi, close side. Demi point, demi, close, rise up for two, down for two, back. And in, to the back, and in, one to the side. Closing in front, rise, one, two, down, two. Yeah, that was pretty fast, especially if we're really thinking about our demi point, point, demi point close, it's quite fast with the music. So you can practice without the music as well, and you can eventually go less like a row box. You look a little bit like a row box, you're going demi point, point, demi point, close. So you're trying to make it nice and smooth. Demi point, demi close. Demi point, demi close. And girls, the next time that we do it, we're looking less like a robot. And we're trying to get a nice strong balance here. Now we're making sure when it's in front, it will be in line with our belly button. Then to the side. Then it goes all the way behind us and it's in line with our bun or our bum. Yes. <laughs> Let's swap legs. So you have the other leg in front now. And we're going to go with a different music. So we just had music A. Now we're using music B. So same counts as what we just did. Again, hands either brother or hands on hips. Shoulders are down, rib cage is closed. And we go to the front. Demi and in. Demi point in. Now on the side. Side in. Squeeze knees up and down to the back. In line with our bum. Down. In. Down. Side. In and rising up. And down. Holding nice and tall. Good girls. I want you to think about what would you have on the inside of your heel? Maybe a sticker that you can kind of show off. Anything that you want, anything like a diamond, whatever you can imagine, on the inside of your heel. And every time that you have your legs, you're thinking that you're trying to show the diamond or the sticker or whatever it is to the front, okay? So when I go to to the front, ooh, there's my sticker, I'm trying to show it off. When I'm to the second, I'm showing it off without my hips going like this, nice and square with our hips, but my leg just rotates out. Same when I go to the back. When I'm at the back, I don't have it pointing out from here. What I do is I try and rotate my leg so you can see the inside of my heel. So from here, I don't go just on the top of my foot, go rotate so that my big toes on the floor. I'm trying to show my heel all the way to the floor and through, okay? Our last exercise on the bar, it's a bit tricky and we have to turn a little bit as well. So instead of doing that, I have this in the other video that I posted and we're gonna do it without the bar again. So any foot in front, it doesn't matter. Your hands can be on your hips to help you balance or if you're feeling really tricky, you can have your arms in second position. Just remember that our second position is not here we have nice long elbows and our palms are facing up a little bit. Okay, so now any foot in front, we go point, lift just off the floor, making sure we're not all wobbly, showing off our sticker, touch the floor, lift, touch the floor. Then we go close, rise, wiggle, 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 tiny little steps all the way into first position. So we were in third, then we're going to first. Same to second, lift, lift, and close to first. So just where you came from. Rise, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. We have the other foot in front. And again, front, lift. Let's go with the music. It'll make more sense when we go with the music. So for me, I'm going to put my hands on the hips for the first time that I do it. Let's go with our music A. Preparation for Grand Babylon. Hands on here. 
Nice finger. Go. Point. Lift. Touch. Lift. Touch. Close. Rise. Quick, quick, quick. Into first position. Same leg. Lift. Touch. Lift. Touch. Close. Rise. And quick, quick, quick. quick into third. Other foot goes point. Lift. Are you showing your butterflies or your stickers? Close, rise, quick, quick, quick into first position and we go point. Lift, touch, lift, touch. Close, rise, quick, 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 quick into third. And we start and finish in the same position. So girls, for that, did you notice that we did a bit of variation? The whole thing wasn't really slow. And we weren't just doing the slow legs. We had an out and a lift. Slow lift, slow close, and I didn't rise really slowly. I went up, and then quick, 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 quick into first. So I want to see very big difference of when we're going really fast and strong, or when we're going really slow. So I'm going to change your feet now, and we're going to change the music as well. Changing our feet over, we have the other foot in front. We're in third position, and we're going to go for music B now. Okay, so it might be a bit more tricky now having to pay attention to different music. Let's go preparation for grog number one. Ready? And up, down, up, down. Close, rise, quick, 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 into first position. Tondus and our preparation for Grand Baton. There's something that we do for both exercises that are super different to our plies. I think maybe our plies have bent legs, while our tondus and our Grand Batons always have super, super straight legs. So now that I'm coming to the center, I want you to think of when we're going to have bent knees bending your trapezoid toes. And when we have straight legs, they're pulling all the way up. Who can pull their kneecaps all the way up and make them really, really strong muscles above the knees? Yeah, good, nice strong dancers. Okay, that's all of your bar done. We're done, good, perfect. All right, so now we're gonna move on. We're gonna move our quarter de bra. We all know our quarter de bra. So I just wanna make sure that there's enough room in front of you because we do have that moment where we go forward and forward and forward, okay? So make sure that there's enough space. Our feet are in first position. And I want you to think, what are we gonna be stepping into that's gonna help us melt? Yeah, so you can imagine that there's some big marshmallows. You're gonna go, oh, step onto the marshmallow, melt onto it, oh, melt, yes? Or there's a big puddle or whatever there is. So you have three of them in front of you, okay? Our feet are in first position. And we're just going to go over the positions of our arms. So we have bra bar to, fit, to start off with. Arms curve up, and this is first. Arms out, and this is second. Arm into our belly button. Just one arm in, one arm out. If we add one and two, we get three. So this is third. Open out to second, into third, out to second. Now it's like you've grabbed a big bunch of flowers and you're throwing them up in the air. So go down, rubber, first, lift it all the way up to fifth and it explodes, oh, big explosion back out to second position. Now we have our little, whatever it is in front of us, it's gonna help us melt. We point that foot towards it, it's just off the floor and we go up and over. Up and mount your feet are together and you're facing one corner. Notice how my arm came in towards me. So if I go this side, this arm's going to come in. So you go in and stretch. Now these last two are a lot faster. I'm going to go into this way. So this arm's going to come in towards me. Melt 
and melt. I have bendy legs and my front arm is going to go down front arm in line with belly button. Down back arm in line with my eyeballs. Not up here, we don't have eyeballs up here, we're not little aliens. Our hands in line with our eyeballs and we go quick, 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 quick. Tiny little runs all the way back into our first position. We start again, we're nice and strong and tall. Go on to the other side, let's do it with music. Alrighty, the sound of normal music to start off with. Hold, very active introduction. Arms first, second, arm belly button, out, arm belly button, out, put it up, and out. We're gonna go this way. Melt and squeeze and melt and melt. Front arm in line with belly button, back arm up. Run, 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 back to first and get up side first. Melting. So our melting exercise is our fondues. If you think of something like a food that melts, it could be a cheese fondue or a chocolate fondue. Yeah, so something really melty. So our fondue exercise, in the other video, I think I broke it down a little bit more with our fondues because it comes into our petit jetés as well. Our fondues, we're gonna go straight into the beginning of the exercise. So I don't mind what leg you put in front. It can be your right or your left or whatever it is. Because we do both sides. So you start in third position. For now, just put your hands on your hips. And we go front foot melts and squeeze. Back foot melts and squeeze. Front foot melts. Now, remember what I said on the inside of your heel, trying to show something off? You're trying to show it off and you stay down. And go melt, 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 show me, show me, show me the inside of your leg. And now, just like we had a marshmallow or something in front of us, something that we're going to melt into, now we're trying to step onto it. So we're going to go step onto it. Notice how much you can move there. So I'm going to say, I'm going to step onto the other side of this mat. I'm going to go melt and up. Yes, try not to make it a jump, but it is a big step. So we're going to step up. Now, Notice what leg is your back leg. We're going to do the full exercise. Notice what leg is your back leg. You're going to turn, 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 and you change your legs. So, before you even get to the back, you're going to turn, 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 change my legs. Keep going, I'm at the back. Keep going, I'm all the way to the front. And you've got the other foot down. Lower your heels. Now, on the other foot, we go melt into a diamond. So it's above our ankle. And squeeze your legs super straight. Melt into a diamond. Squeeze super straight. Melt into your diamond. Show me the inside of your heel forward. Step past it into a tight fifth. Turn to your back foot. Remember, we need to go really fast into changing our legs. So I'm going to change my legs. That again. I change my legs. 
And then I keep that leg, I keep that leg, I keep that leg, and then lower down. And you're still in your third position, just like when you started. So you finish how you started. Now, let's think. Let's do it once without our arms, so we can just put our hands on our hips and we get used to that because we really want to show our heels forward. And it's not a very easy exercise once we're thinking about all of our technique of closing our ribs and having our shoulders down, having our knees track over our toes, showing our heels forward, stepping really far. It's a lot to think about. So we're going to do it with our music first, with just our legs, hands on our hips. And then if we're super tricky, we're gonna try with our arms as well. So, music A for fondues. Ready, front foot. Melt, squeeze straight legs. Melt back foot, squeeze straight legs. Front foot, heel, step past it, change your legs. Turn, hold, lower down. Front foot, squeeze. Yes, 
Our arms can sway with this. So okay, down and the sway, down and the sway, down and the sway, down and the sway. So listen to that with the music. inside of your leg, okay? But we are focused on keeping those shoulders down, blinking over in really tall here, okay? So let's do it with our transfer forward, back, forward, back, triple run, triple run, and then we're gonna run over to the other side and do it on the other side, okay? Let's go. Tricky exercise. 
After this, we're going to get into your glissades and your glissades, okay? So from here, adage. Let's do this with music. We've got our feet in third position to start now. Turn 
you're going different ways, yeah? So releve, down, front, front, releve, down, turn, jump, first foot, slow the third. Then the second time we go the other way and we have the other foot in front. All right, good girls. That is all for today. We can add some more jumps and everything like that in later. Um, after this, if you have some spare time, what I would like you to start practicing is, just remember this music. of our body and another color on the back of our body that's what I want you to practice okay before we see you again have one color jump hop and I'm seeing another color out jump hop I see the other color make sure that you'll keep turning the same way though okay girls I don't want to see you just do front and back and front and back you need to do a full turn around so it's like we're skipping up and skip, and skip, yeah? And you're going along the line. If you're practicing that, try and do six in a row, and then step together. All right, girls, thank you. Make sure you check out the other video that I posted because it does break down your um, petit jetés and your fondues a little bit more. Bye.